Are we really just gonna ignore the fact that killer whales give sharks PTSD? Welcome to Animal Logic, let's talk about it. Orcas are the most disrespectful animal on the planet, and that's exactly what happens when no one can check you. Other than humans, the only thing that can take on an orca and win is a bigger orca. Because of the top of the food chain, orcas bully the entire underwater census and they legitimately traumatize great white sharks. If Jaws happens to encounter an orca near their hunting grounds, they'll abandon the area for up to a year. And for good reason. Orcas actually figured out that if they flip over sharks, they can induce tonic immobility, paralyzing the shark while the Bundy dolphins take its liver, heart, testes, and probably its life too. Killer whales have been seen punting seals up to 80 feet in the air just like a field goal. Researchers believe they do this to either paralyze the seal or loosen its skin. But there's always that chance that these psychopaths do this because they find joy in putting a seal in the clouds. They're also intelligent enough to work together to create a wave that's so powerful that it knocks the seal completely off the ice. And just when he thinks he's safe on the beach, Steroid Flipper reminds him it's an orca's world and he just lives in it. And even though they're built like an 8 to 12,000 pound equality symbol, they can launch themselves up to 15 feet in the air. Really bad news if you're a bottlenose in the raw.